Okay. Oh my god, look at all that ammo. Oh, I didn't even see this last time. Goodness. Oh, shit. They don't play around. Oh, I can't take anymore. Wow. Anyways. We are... Uh, 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 this is the Game Virus. Also known as the G, -G, 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 -G Virus. And we are back with more. Let's play Resident Evil Dead Aim Blind. And on the last episode, we found an effing save point. So I can finally stop stressing and hyperventilating about the fact that I didn't have a save for two whole videos and rest easy now because we have finally saved. We tried to get used to the controls, we slayed a few zombies. We came across that hot girl who threw a grenade at us and she kicked our face around a bit. We had some cheesy one-liners exchanged back and forth between the both of us. And uh, you know, I'm really digging the look of this game and the feel. It's absolutely B-horror personified to the max here. It's just got that B-horror vibe with that nice chilling atmosphere and it's trying way too hard to be cool, which is exactly what I want from a Resident Evil game. I love it. However, the gameplay is utter shite. I'm not enjoying that. It could just be because I'm having a hard time controlling the guy. The controls are shit, you know, and I'm not still not used to non-inverted controls and not having the option to do that, so. But yeah, the game's very moody and very dark. I have no idea what direction I was trying to go in when I left this thing. I like how some rooms are just opened up. All right, buddy, we'll see if we can take you out. This guy's stumbling about as I stumble with my aim. Oh, okay, that wasn't even a headshot, but I got a critical hit, a critical hit on him somehow. And it looks like we got another card key at that. Oh, it's an ID card. ID card taken. Can I examine stuff? I don't think I can. No, no, we can't examine stuff. That, that, that's a big, huge staple of Resident Evil games is the ability to examine items, but the game is not structured that way. Oh, nice to see that the herb stack, so there won't be any need for item management. I don't even think I can even run out of items, probably. I know there's a limit to how much handgun bullets I can hold. Six different sets of handgun rounds All right, and they only stack up to 30 so I'm definitely good on ammo uh, silencer? silenced handgun is good for avoiding detection when attacking so I, I gotta it's gonna be weird employing stealth against zombies in Resident Evil I'm not used to such such a concept but okay oh shit what the fuck oh shit <laughs> Do they know I'm here? Can I turn off my flashlight? See, what's the point of being stealthful? What the hell is that? Oh, oh, shit. I was telling me there's somebody around me. Fuck. Oh, man. I didn't bargain. Oh, my God. It's a straight-up ambush. Oh, fuck. I'm dead. First death coming up here. Does he start limping? He doesn't even start limping. I should probably just take off, but these guys really effed me up and I'm mad. Well, I got the bullets. Oh man. Man, I couldn't hit that guy at all. Jeez, I was just shooting an outline around him, just not connecting at all. Oh my god, are you kidding me? How do I coming from all sides. This guy coming from behind. I wonder if the enemies respawn. They probably do. I know, I know he's right there. See, okay, that's how we move. I keep forgetting to push L2 down in order to move. Random. I'm swearing, I'm, I'm telling you that thing is random when you, when, when you get a critical hit. It's totally random. Muscle memory is definitely telling me to try to use the right analog stick to move the camera. And I can if I hold down L2. 
but it's, uh, it's, it's, it's it's telling me to move the camera around when I'm in that third person mode too, and it's just creating it's just creating problems for me, man. It's so frustrating. It's very hard to go back to this game after like the way things play nowadays, the way games play nowadays. This shit is so difficult. No, can't go that way. I thought we came from this direction, but obviously not. But we did. This is a save point was at, or is this a different save point? This is the same. I can grab some bullets while I'm at it. I'm gonna restock after that encounter. So what's my health looking like? Caution. I can take an herb. Puts me all the way in fine. It was an orange caution. Then again, I don't even know if there's orange and, and green caution. I think it's just fine, caution, and danger. They really simplified things. You unlock the door. I remember there was a door that was locked from the other side. Could this be that door? Everything looks the same. I can't tell if I'm, like... If I've already been in a place or not. Okay, well... Alright, so we have an ID card. Does the map tell us what we can go into now? Okay, blue means that I can't enter. Hmm, maybe I should try the VIP room? Bathroom? Red room, captain room. Yeah, I have no idea where I'm supposed to be going. Fuck, as a matter of fact, I'm turned around that quickly. So I just need to turn around. Let's try to go. I don't know if those guys are dead or they're just waiting to come alive on me. I'm pretty sure they're just waiting to come alive on me and nibble on my face. If I can get the maneuvering down, I can dodge these guys and save ammo, or just... Because I'm getting hit a lot when I try to shoot, too, so... Even though I don't really need to save ammo, I would avoid taking damage by sitting there and trying to shoot them. I don't know where I'm going! Should I go downstairs? I think I need to go down and mess... Maybe I should try to mess with that panel again and unlock doors on maybe the third or first floor. What floor could I mess with stuff on? It's right here. You used the ID card. Perfect. Good stuff. What floor is unlocked now? The floor I'm on? Yep, the floor I'm on. Doesn't tell me. I got a bad feeling about this room right here. Oh, shit. Oh, kitchen. Oh, I thought that was an enemy right there. I was about to say he's just standing there quietly. Hold on, let me let me try to stay in the sneak mode. I just picked up that those bullets with L2. What the f? See, you you can't turn his perspective at all unless you let go of L2, which then I start making noise. So doesn't that make sneaking like? Kind of useless or like broken. Oh my god. Oh man, that's an extreme close up of this guy. It keeps happening. There's no point to keep on trying to sneak. Oh shit. Oh, shotgun. Oh, well, that'll make things a bit easier as far as dispatching foes now, won't it? Absolutely take that. Please don't rise up. I don't want any excuse to try to use the shotgun right now in such close quarters. Ah! I cannot carry anymore! Throw away your handgun bullets and pick up this ammo! No, 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 wait a minute. I'll throw away some handgun bullets, but not all of them. How do I discard shit? I can't discard. All right, I'll play along. Uh, what? What? 
Did I throw away all of them or just one? Oh man, I don't like the way that works. Seems like managing your bullets is kind of kind of screwed up. Let's go ahead and equip that though. It's weird not being asked if I'm sure I want to equip this or not. It, it kind of just go ahead. It, it, it kind of just goes ahead and go, go goes ahead and just does it. All right. Well, I don't know what these what this is supposed to be like things of meat. Are they all rotten? Is that why they're all gray like that? It's like huge slabs of something right there. It's really weird. Oh shit! That's loud as fuck! That shit hurt my ears. So if you thought I was gonna stay there and try to do battle with those guys, you're sadly mistaken. Shotgun or not, I'm out of there. That would be a colossal waste of bullets, seeing as it doesn't seem like we need to go back in there ever. Man, where did I come from? Okay, I came from that door. I can hear zombies. Maybe I, you know what, I'm not gonna use the shotgun. I'll use it once just to see what it sounds like and the damage it deals, but I'm gonna, it seems to be closed. I'm gonna stick with the handguns when dispatching zombies because I know more ruthless enemies will show, oh shit! I know more ruthless enemies will show their face. Uh, Woo! Yeah, that's a one-hitter quitter. Yeah, we'll we'll go ahead and save that for the for the more uh, imposing enemies. That will come our way, I'm sure, really soon. Oh, bullets. Uh, maybe I shouldn't, you know what, I, I don't have any room for it. I was gonna not pick them up, actually, in case I run across shotgun bullets. I need more shotgun bullets. Did you see what that thing did? That gun is a force to be reckoned with. Oh! We are on the deck. Or outside of the cabin area. There's enemies all over the place. Is this where we had that big exchange with that... What are these two doing? You see this? Do you see this shit? What happens if I shoot them? Fuck. Can I go over to this pool and... No, I can't. Is there even anything out here? I probably shouldn't even be out here yet. I'm just exploring, basically. Is that a door? No, it's for life jackets. You unlock the door. Okay, maybe this will bring me to an area that I couldn't get into previously. Maybe this is just the other side of where I was already at. Oh. Gotta look around, man. Almost missed that herb. Good thing I looked to my left. Gosh, the environments are bland as all hell, and they all look samey, but it is very dark, and I like that. Okay, this basically just brought me back in there. I wonder if... I'm gonna go back out to that deck and see if... It's the pool deck, I believe. I'm gonna see if there's anything important out there I need to grab up. Could be an item. No, we can't even go over there. Oh, first aid spray. How did we miss that? Thank goodness I decided to come back. Oh, here we go. Something we can press. A key is sticking in the panel. Take the maintenance key. Maintenance key? Maintenance key taken. Uh oh. What the hell is that? The lid slid away, revealing a pressurized hatch. There is a warning label on the hatch. Oh! Administ ad administration report? 9-16-2002. We will begin the facility improvements today. The handle to open and close the hatch for pool drain on first floor is quite rusty and should be replaced. We'll keep the current one in the storage of, one of, of first floor just in case. 
All right, we'll keep the current one in the storage of the first floor, just in case. So the handle is on the first floor for the pool drain. All right. You added the blah, blah, blah report, blah, blah, blah. So whenever we get the ID card that will allow us shit to unlock the first floor, that's when we'll pretty much find the valve or whatever the F it's called that will screw around with that. second floor where the staircase, the spiral staircase is. But once again, I am lost. Because everything looks the same! But I think I found the door. Alright, now did I check every single door? Is this all just gonna lead me back to that area? No. It's locked. It's locked. Well, I know two doors were unlocked. They can't all just be connected to the same area. This has to take me to someplace else. Is this the same area? No, it's not. Uh-oh. Maybe it is. What the fuck? What am I hearing? Zombies. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, come on. Up. These guys were like, super aggressive. They were really after me. Some of them decide to move quick on me. Some of them, like this guy, just take their sweet time. Uh, I'm not gonna try to make sense of it. Oh, there's tons of. Uh oh. There's tons of rooms to investigate here. Lots of different zombie models. This guy has on a, 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 an undershirt. First one wearing something like that that we've seen. Uh, I keep forgetting that we don't need to actually push X to get the prompt. That stuff is locked. Although it does take a second to pop up. We could find out quicker by just mashing X. Uh oh. There's a, there's a zombie in here. Good stuff. Oh, look at that! Blood splatter on the wall? Man, I'm really interested in playing this with the gun con. It probably would have controlled better and everything. Maybe. Probably not. That's a cool shot. Just broken glass. The shower curtain's all fucked up. Zombie laid up against the wall. With blood on the wall, and I did that. Alright, well... I'm gonna go back and save. If I can find my way back. I think this is where I came from. Everything looks the effing same. Yeah, this is where I came from. Now it'll be a struggle to find the save point, man. I don't know where that thing is at. Um... It was on this floor? Second floor, yes. See if I can find the save room. I remember the door was different from all the other doors. These guys still aren't rising up, which is good. I don't know if this is the right spot, though. Oh man, just ran around in circles. Aw, oh, shit. Uh, I might just cut it here and find the safe point on my own. Is this the same... Is this the same hall? Yeah, it looks the same. It looks like the same damn hall. Oh, I need a safe point. 
There's, the save points are so far, few and far between. Oh, shit. Alright, well, I'm gonna cut it here. And when I get back, I will have found the save point. Hopefully. Hopefully I don't take damage trying to find it either. But if you liked the video, feel free to like it. And if you want more, feel free to subscribe. And I'll see you guys next episode on Let's Play Resident Evil Dead A. Blind. This is the Game Virus. Thanks for watching. Later.